G'day everyone, I'm Voodoo and welcome back to the channel and welcome to round 11 of tips and rips. So let's get into the tips without further ado. Uh, last round, round 10, we did end up getting six of nine. Um, not bad, not great, but not bad. Take six of nine. It's uh, probably just, just borderline okay. All right, so let's get into round 11 tips. All right, starting off on Friday, we got Sydney and Carlton. Sydney aren't going great, but neither are Carlton. This one, hmm. Is that Sydney's home ground? Oof, this is a hard one. I'm going to go with Carlton on this one. I haven't seen the teams just yet, so if... Once that comes out, I might make a change on that one, but just depending on if Sydney get anyone coming back because they are pretty much depleted in the back line. All right, on to the next, St. Kilda and Hawthorne. Um, I think this is a uh, pretty one-sided game. Hawthorne had a win last week, but it was against West Coast and that doesn't really matter. That is uh, a second, uh, was it? A waffle side pretty much at the moment, so yeah, the, the less said the better. Uh, all right, on to Melbourne and Fremantle. I'm gonna go on the upset here. It's at the MCG, but I'm gonna go Frio. Is the uh, the flag mantle back on, on track? <laughs> Who knows? This will this will decide if if they can get over Melbourne this week, then I will I'll be back on the uh, the flag mantle train. All right, moving on to Geelong and GWS. Geelong at their home grounds. I don't think they will lose this one. Um, they Coming off the back of two losses, you think that they'd have to respond and uh, I'm sure they're going to get back someone back this week. A couple of players back that will make them stronger. All right, next one, we've got Gold Coast Suns and Western Bulldogs. Both playing okay football. Or in the case of Western Bulldogs, they're playing really good football. And on that, I will go the Dogs. All right. Uh, West Coast and Essendon. Yeah, I think everyone knows who's going to win that one. Though West Coast did win against Essendon last year uh, at Optus. So, is there a small chance? There's always a small chance, but I don't, don't see it happening. <laughs> All right, Richmond and Port Adelaide. Uh, Port absolutely flying. Richmond just, um, uh, Damien Hardwick just retired. So will that, the uh, will, what's the word for it? Will it um, get a rise out of the Richmond players and will they perform better? Oof. I think history says that. Like, hmm. I think yeah, history says that. Like, uh, what's the word for it? Um, the uh, caretaker coaches that usually take over, usually win. But in this case, I think Port will break the mold. And uh, I think they're too strong, too too good at the moment. And I'm sure they're going to get Charlie Dixon and a few others back this week, which will make them stronger. Uh, all right, go to the next one. We've got Collingwood North Melbourne. Yeah, I don't see Collingwood losing this one. I think they will uh, absolutely hammer North Melbourne this week. And then we got Adelaide Crows and Brisbane Lions, which is uh, not an easy one to pick either. Adelaide, up and down. Brisbane, really, really good. But they're due for that one where they just don't play well. Every now and then, they just absolutely have a mare. And... <sighs> no, I'm going to stick with Lions. I think they are too strong at the moment, but... Yeah, I think that's going to be a good game. That one, the last game on Sunday. So there we go. There's my tips for round 11. What do you reckon? How many reckon I'm going to get? <laughs> get a cut, get down to six of nine. I'll be happy with that at least. All right. So yeah, we got Carlton, St Kilda, Frio, uh, Geelong, Western Bulldogs, Essendon, Port Adelaide, North Melbourne. Oh, sorry, not Melbourne. Collingwood, not North Melbourne. Oh, and uh, Brisbane Lions. <laughs> do not do that mistake. All right, so we've done the uh, tip part of the video. We're gonna go into some rips, and uh, this week we have some Footy Stars Hobby Packs. So I've got a couple packs here. 
Um, footy stars haven't been great to me this year. Um, let's see if the uh, the hobby version of uh, footy stars can uh, change my thinking of them this year. So just a quick look at the, uh, the chase cards that you can get. I'd love an instant win uh, or an iconic. Any of the uh, predictors would be nice as well. So let's uh, let's crack open this one and see if we can get something good. All right. Just uh, crossing my fingers for some luck. All right, here we go. Whole bunch of base cards. And first one off the bat, we do have West Coast Eagles. Um, Luke Shuey, The Essentials, which is... Uh, I'll take that. I'll take the essentials. And underneath that, we only have a parallel. So uh, nothing else in this pack, I don't think. Just double check, make sure there's nothing hiding in the pack. All right, let's open the, the next pack. Oh, not from that owner, I guess. The pack did not want to open. All right, here we go. Pack number two. Can we get anything better from this pack? We've got an AFL milestone. Uh, Will Hayward from Sydney, the 100 games, and that's in the uh, the bronze. And uh, just another parallel, unfortunate. All right, just double check, nothing in there. Let's move up to the side. All right, a couple more packs to go for this one. And I'll leave you to it. All right, here we go. Pack number three. Come on, luck. Change the luck. Another milestone, 100 games. For Fremantle this time, Darcy Tucker in the bronze. And underneath that, just another parallel. Getting no luck, are we? Oh, seriously. Start to an, not annoy me, but frustrate me, I guess you, the word would be. Frustrate, I'm not getting anything. Oh, that's the way it goes, unfortunately. And sometimes you get years and years of luck, and then this year seems to get um, almost no luck. All right, so here we go, final pack. See if we can get anything today. Finish on a high. And we do have an ACL classified. And under that is just another parallel. So we did get something. We got a, uh, oh, I do actually have uh, one of these. So we put it underneath to show you what it looks like. So there we go. The AFL classified, Dustin Heffel, number 259. So not the uh, the best looking card, I guess you could say. The, uh, the classifieds, the acetates, I'll leave it on there. Bring over the other hits. Uh, but, um, yeah, it's better than nothing, I guess you could say. All right, so here we go. These are the hits for the day. There we go. Yeah, I don't know what else to say, I guess. Um, leave a comment down below. What, what, do you, what tips did you pick? What teams did you tip, should I say, as I mince my words? Uh, do you reckon we've got a good chance getting nine this week? We have got nine before, so um, let's see if we can get it again. And there we go, the uh, the hits for today's from today's packs. All right, I'm just going to stop waffling on, and uh, I think I'll leave you there. <laughs> All right, enjoy today. Cheers.